Hi, this is Kathy Brox of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at lutgradio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is the Let Us Thank God LUTG Radio Morning Show with Kathy Brox. Let's win some souls, play some music, and have some fun in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hey, hey, hey. All right, praise the Lord. We got uh, music for you. Definitely me, you, the Holy Ghost, Jesus. Hallelujah, it's a party. Party, 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 party. Uh... <laughs> And um, we also have um, the vocabulary word coming up around 17, 18 minutes from now. And the ministry minutes in the last 15 minutes of this segment as well as we're looking for some people to call in to uh, tell us about their poem, what they created, why they created, what it's all about. If they can say it in 30 seconds, that would be great. Amen. Or you can call in and do uh, impromptu, an improv poem or a 30 second rap. Just give your name and I'll give you a word. Do a 30 second rap. Oh, don't forget, check out Arts and Entertainment. Uh, my, uh, you can go to lutgradio.com and just click on the A&E, and it'll take you straight to my column. We have a new article up there called Amazing Grace. <laughs> we won't sing it. <laughs> I forgot it costs money. Uh, but it's by John Newton, who was born back in 1725. He's actually a slave trader, and he became a Christian. It, it got changed his heart, but uh, so definitely check out the article, read it for yourself. Amen, amen, and share it with a friend. The musical is uh, coming to Broadway uh, October 9th, so definitely check that out. Amen, amen. Hallelujah! We have more music for y'all. Here's um here's a song by uh, Miss Shawana Hayes. You can check her out at uh, shawanahayes.com. As well as at the uh, Chicago Hilton Hotel. Amen. Bread and butter. Hallelujah. Here we go. Free to be me.
stand, trying to follow the trends. Do whatever we can to be accepted by friends. Some act like Xerox and copy what they see. I had to drop a song called Free to Be Me. But in case you missed it, I went back and remixed it. Cause I know peer pressure and how things get twisted. Some kids get picked on like you wouldn't believe. Teased and even told that they wouldn't succeed. So tired of being bullied that they look at fatigue. Well, this song's for y'all. Sing along and repeat it. Make it your Facebook status, text and tweet it. Put it on blast so everybody can see it. Lift your head up high and believe that you got it going on all by yourself. So receive it. There's only one 
last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We in the last days, Revelation say. Jesus coming back, but we don't know what day. We keep walking around like we don't know the way. Pray without ceasing is what God's words say. Earthquakes, wildfires, it's all explained. Repent from your sins, give your life and change. If you don't do it, then you won't be saved. It don't matter how much money, material, things, or fame. It ain't gonna last forever, it just pass away. It's 1,000 years to us, for God is a day. I gotta stay a saint, no matter what you think. I don't care about no titles, no names, or rank. The Bible say when he come, we already won. But you gotta give your heart and mind to the sun. If you still in bondage, there's nowhere to run. You're trying to find the answers, but there's only one. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. He said he spit you out his mouth if you only lukewarm. Get yourself together. Let him take you by the arm. The race ain't given to the swift or the strong. You got to end with through wall and move on. Jesus already defeated sin for me, but he's coming back again to kill it again. If you still in that sin, then you die too. And your eternity looks hot for you. You're going to stand alone in front of the king of kings. And when he looks at your life, what do you think he sees? Did you do good works and obey the word? Was you producing good fruit or hate and hurt? If God is first, then where's the evidence? Living any kind of way don't make much sense. Make up your mind. Don't straddle the fence. Get you some wisdom. Don't be so dense. We in the last days. You got to pray. Get yourself together. Walk in his ways. We in the last days. Don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We should be striving for perfection, asking his direction. Praying for forgiveness, saying thanks for his protection. With so much wickedness, corrupting the earth. It's people dying off and living with hurt. God didn't intend for us to live this way. All we need is him to get through each day. Pray for life. And live it right. Walk by faith. Forget about sight. Use his might to fight the battles. When the enemy comes, you can run and get at him. Sin is dark and hell is hot. And God is everything the world is not. Stay away from Satan and his evil plots. Put your armor on and block his shots. He tries to confuse, get you lost in a maze. He wants you lost and halfway crazy. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. We in the last days, you got to pray. Get yourself together, walk in his ways. We in the last days, don't stay lost. If you don't change, you'll be paying the cost. Jehovah, but I ain't knocking on your daughter, convert you, over, Jesus is 
got it simple. That's all, that's it. Believe in a move forward. Cause hellfire is a backflip. So tune your antenna to the modus operandi. Operation Mana. Bread from heaven to live by. Jesus in the Santa. The only way to enter. The gates of heaven with splendor and glory. Surrender. Your broken heart to the mender. He'll fix it within ya. He's too, too tender. The too, true lender. Putting false gods in the blender. Remember the beef ender. When death renders, he's the door that all that the dead will enter. Unclaimed. Download. The unclaimed. Download. Unclaimed. Download. Rhyme in, it's time to fold the flag and pass it to my wife. The spirit bringeth life, regardless of the turmoil and the plight. The king's domain expects by those who take up the fight. Up the fight. Uh, fight. What you thought fight. that I was small? This is a coincidence that David's predecessor shared the same name as Paul. So I understand redemption. Seeds planted dispatching the roots, blood covered contravention. Implementation of the cross, it applies. We preach Christ crucified. How you gonna stop resurrection? How you gonna stop a mustard tree from its direction? Uh, bruh, love and M triple. J love more than hype, buzz, smoke, or sizzle. Not Africa, dapper, poof, and fizzle. Don't slam it to that oak tree. Sleeping on these oak leaves because we came in low key. Act like you don't know we first to make these holy hits. And we only need you to please stay tuned. Thanks for your support. Now, everybody in the room, say it. Con clay, down, low. The con clay, down, low. Con clay, down, for so. There's a higher calling, we focus not falling. Grown in this walk, our pace is steady, not crawling. Full of the spirit, my team is going all in. Confident in Christ, cause he overcame a world of sin. This begin atonement, the basic key component. Sacrificing all I am for a God moment. Pour the oil on it, set the fire to it. Smell the sweetness of it, the meekness of it. No spot of blemish, a holy chemist. Now it is finished, love won't diminish. He assembled us together to bring it to you straight from the source, not sitting in the booth. You lost, there's a clue, thinking false, here's the truth. Feel old, get renewed by the word flowing to you. Don't be afraid, the decision is made. Your life debt is paid, Christ came to save. Authority, power, respect he gave. This is just the introduction. Welcome to the conclave. Yeah. You telling me to restore my brother if my spirit is right, reinstate my brother. Instead, we go expose my brother. Opportunities right, man. Who is my brother? You telling me to restore my brother if my spirit is right, reinstate my brother. Instead, we go expose my brother if the money is right, man. Who is my brother? Yo, I know you feel, but I can't even my shell, made you the same thing that your frame is, indigenous so my aim is, to paint a picture with small strokes, not even to mention the bristles, on all of my drawing utensils broke, so I'm injecting my index, it's simplex, but it's all hope, see I'm pointing you to that light spring, cause I go with the flow, I know what I know, when ain't no glow when you try things, you gotta be ready for making that shift, the burden we carry gon' carry your sin, what's scary you than to be buried in sin, so I'm forgiven but covered in jam, you fucking but kill him and tell you, living your life can never help you, either you hate it to heaven, you can't with the love and you bang with the breath of a hit with the tell you I'm telling I've been there, and not because then, but I'm still here. If ever sees me, that I'm still with, cause my cup full, but I still chill. Now, here, here, take a moment in time to relax and recline until his rest. Yeah, that's new wine from a new vine, do the Jesse for his new times, expressly written, especially. First Timothy 4, yeah. bless me, bro, I can help you let me. Yeah. You told me to restore my brother if my spirit is right. I'm about to be honest tonight. What? Turn up, no grass, no perp, no rock. 
Amen, amen, amen. Do apologize for the technical difficulties. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen, amen. We're just having a few issues this morning. They'll get all worked out. Hallelujah. So I actually do have the vocabulary word for you today. I'm going to have that coming up for you in just a minute. A amen. Hallelujah. Amen, amen. Hi, this is Kathy Brox of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at lutgradio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today. All right, praise the Lord. Amen, amen. Jesus loves him some you, beloved. This is straight up the truth. Hallelujah. And he would basically have it no other way than for you to be blessed. Amen, amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I actually have words and not a phrase today. So the word probar means to taste, which I did not know that. So your vocabulary word for today is probar, which means to taste. Amen. As in, that tastes good. Que es probar. <laughs> que es probar. That tastes good. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we get uh, ministry minutes coming up right after this. We just um, working through this. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We got more music for you and another opportunity for salvation. Here's Taste Fears Depression. Yeah. Well, this is for that person who's never felt comfortable in their own skin. Who felt like they weren't good enough. Yo, let's listen to the words. Yeah, little homie was born in the burbs, African American, not knowing his worth. So every day he stepped outside to go kicking it. He was reminded how his life was so different. He got the backlash of children with no discipline. Got teased, his skin tone made him a misfit. So why risk it? He stayed in the house and laid low as they sent threats from outside of his window. Wanted to be bright skin, blue eyes and blind hair. How little homie was living his life in despair. It started with fear, but fear turned to hatred. But now they get stemmy, hated who God created. Hated dude in the mirror, wanted to be basic. He thought basic was outside of his race, and he felt wasted. But little did he know that God wants to bring him out the situation. Yeah, I know you're dealing with depression, right? Everything up in your life just never goes right. But don't give in, homeboy, know you gotta fight. Break the chains of depression. Yeah, we break the chains of depression. Yeah, let's break the chains of depression. Yeah, the chains of depression. Lil Mama was very active in youth church. Great student, she aced all of her schoolwork. Seemed perfect, but no one knew that she hurt. Cause her father was never around to see her. And the fact that she wasn't a figure eight, it caused low self esteem. She hated how she was shaped. Hated to look in the mirror, never wanted to see how far she was from the girls in the magazine. So she went on hiding how she truly feels. But what's it and always finds herself being revealed. Hers came from scars that she tried to keep. Made with a-
with a purpose. God made you more important than the earth is. So for the times that you felt worthless, you were wonderfully made. See, that's what the word says. And even if by the world you get ignored, God feels you were enough for him to die for. So don't search for your significance in them. Because God wants you to see your beauty is in him. All right. Your beauty is in the Lord. And speaking of depression, God has scriptures to help you with depression. There's uh, Judges 15 and 8. Uh, that is, uh, depression can follow exhausting times, but God is a deliverer. 2 Samuel 22, verses 29 to 31. 1 Kings 19, 3 and 4. Psalms 34 and 8. And Romans 4, 18 and 22, which I'm going to read to you. Because Abraham had no reason to believe. He had no reason to hope. But he kept his faith. In the, new, new, the New Living Translation, uh, verse 18, chapter 4. When God promised Abraham that he would become the father of many nations, Abraham believed him. God had also said, your descendants will be as numerous as the stars, even though such a promise seemed utterly impossible. And Abraham's faith did not weaken. Even though he knew that he was too old to be a father, at the age of 100 and that Sarah, his wife, had never been able to have children. Abraham never wavered in, in believing God's promise. In fact, his faith grew stronger. And in him, I'm, I'm sorry, and in this he brought glory to God. He was absolutely convinced that God was able to do anything he promised. And because of Abraham's faith, God declared him to be righteous. Amen. That's what I believe. That's why I tell people, don't tell me God can't do something. I don't want to hear that. Because whatever he says is, uh, he can't even lie. If he can't lie, then that means, you know, all things are possible. People lie when they can't do stuff or when they don't want to do stuff. Now, if God don't want to do something, he'll say, I don't want to do it. He'll say no. He don't have a problem saying no. But there's, there's nothing that he is not able to do. So I totally believe the Lord will completely heal all of me. Amen, amen. And make me prosperous, like it says in um, 3 John 2. Beloved, above all things, I wish that thou mayest prosper and be in health. Yeah, that's for me. That's for me. That's for you and everybody listening. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Here is Victorious One. Have victory in Christ Jesus. Nakia Young.
birth, baby. It's <laughs> what I do. It's who I am. God's child, what? All right, praise the Lord, victorious one. Amen. You are victorious in Christ Jesus. Amen. When you receive Jesus Christ into your heart, you become a new creature. Old things have become old. All things have become new. That's 2 Corinthians 5, 17. And it is for real. Amen, amen. It's for real, baby, baby. Don't you know God is an, is an exciting God. He's a prosperous God. He prospered your soul by saving it, forgiving you of all your sins, gave your way back to him. And then he prospered you in health, financially, I mean, relationship with him. Man, Jesus is it. He is like that. He's the apex. He really is. Amen. There's only one way to God. That's through Jesus. Let's get that. Let's get on that path right now. <laughs> Amen. Let's get saved today. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. If, if you do not know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, but want to, repeat this prayer confession after me. Lord Jesus, I ask you to forgive me of all my sins. I confess my sins before you this day. I denounce Satan and all his works. I confess Jesus as the Lord of my life. Thank you for saving me and for bringing me back to where I once was. From this day forward, Lord Jesus, I will be sensitive to how you feel. I won't hurt you. I will obey you. Lord Jesus, I ask you to present me to Jehovah in your name. Lord Jesus, I believe with my heart, I confess with my mouth that you rose from the dead, that I am saved and receive you today wholeheartedly, 100%. Make me a light in a dark place, and from this day forward, I will leave this place and share you with everyone I meet and everyone I know. It's commitment, Jesus. I will get this world for you. I pray this prayer to the Father, in the name of Jesus, amen. I receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus, with evidence of speaking in tongues, for the edifying of the body of Christ Jesus by the will of Jehovah God. Amen. Congratulations. Go to letgradionetwork.com. Click on the link, find a church. Get baptized with water. Take your foundation class and your prayer intercessory class. Tell everyone you got saved on the LUTG radio. Amen, amen. Congratulations again. Read your Bible every day. Start off with the book of John chapter 1. Don't miss and know that Jesus absolutely loves you, beloved, 100%. And we got to follow me to the next segment. Get about 10 or 15 minutes of just straight music. Hey, man, here's so Block. If they only knew. Turn the temple to a marketplace. Same guys that would claim they had the hardest faith. This well after they first started hate. Lord, I see now why your countenance departed face. Grab some cords, made a scourge and extended heat. Cast them out with the ox, doves, and the sheep. Overturning table, scared they on bended knees. You done turned my father's house into a den of thieves. Uh, this was supposed to be devotion hour. He was preaching in the temple and promoting power. Telling us we can obtain it if we open our hearts, heal the sick, causing the commotion louder. 
Shout Hosanna to the son of David. Even cheering felt the spirit and they started praising. But the Pharisees and Sadducees were so displeased they set them up to be obliterated. If they only knew. If they only knew. If they only knew. In the beginning was the word. And the world was all blessed. And the world was with God. Then the world was made flesh. In the garden of Gethsemane, took Peter and the two sons of Zebedee. Keep watch, I need y'all to peep. But when he came back to them, they was all asleep. Jesus said, You couldn't watch for me one hour. They ain't understand, situation getting sour. They ain't understand, Judas coming with a crowd. Men with swords, Peter proved that he wasn't coward. Struck the servant of the high priest. Cutting off his ear, Jesus felt the need to teach. Live by the sword, die from it, I want peace. Cause I could call 12 legion angels if I wanted be. But how would the scriptures be fulfilled? So go and let them do it, I'ma chill. Together they was unified, and the son of men was seized and crucified. If they only knew. 